Good morning, I'm Chip. Hey, good morning, I'm Steve. And this is uh, Chip's, Chip's Garage. Garage. The reason he hesitated, as you could probably see, once again, we're at a different place. We're at Steve's house. So we're Chip's Garage at Steve's house, Steve's house at is, Steve's is, Garage. Uh, Steve's Garage. Well, it's still Chip's yeah, Garage. Well, there's still there's Chip's Garage. Always will be Chip's <laughs> Garage, okay? <laughs> anyway, today we're gonna show you something super cool and it's why we're over here. And this is Steve's car. So. Steve, I'm not even gonna say anything. I take uh, off, buddy. Uh, this thing. No, I, no. Wait, wait. Uh, I uh, picture. Uh, you know Droopy. You remember Droopy, the cartoon character? Yeah, yeah, about, yeah. I, every time I see his car, I picture him driving it. No. I, uh, yeah, uh, I think. I think in one hey, of the wait, cartoons. Wait, wait, wait. Like his name of the clown car. We're gonna get the big <laughs> wind up for the back. Ah, uh, there okay. you go. A you clown know, car. Uh, actually, I inherited it. Uh, he's like a big brother to me. Uh, he's still alive, but I, he says I would like to have it. So I was honored to get it because I was driving home and was looking in the rearview mirror. It was on a trailer saying how ugly this thing is. I'm bringing home. My wife's going to kill me. Yeah. Well, she'd kill me if I got rid of it. She loves this car. This car is cool. She's equal man. to the Merc. She loves that, my car. They don't even know what it is yet. Most okay, people well, don't know what this is. You'll probably never see another one. Well, it's a 1947 Crosley two door. I put this out at the car shows because yeah. um, people like freak out. Uh, I've had, I bet you I had four hours of talking when I went to a car show that oh, one day. You know, I've had people, well, you were telling me people don't even leave you alone, right? No, 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 yeah. no. They want to sit in it and everything. It, what's really neat is you and I and, and two other uh, our size can fit in that car. Oh, I know. It's amazing the room in that car. I know. But it's a 1947 Crosley. Uh, back in, uh, uh, before the war, um, there was a guy that um, started building these Crosley cars, but he made, um, um, Radios and refrigerators first. Really? Pre-war and post-war. Yeah. And then wow. after this, he made this up to 52. Yeah. Now, this is an American car. American car. You would think it was everybody, like English car or something. Everybody says it's English. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, and it isn't. But it's probably just like... Come, yeah. Before you do, come okay. get a, a look at this front end. And it says... Crosley, a fine car. A fine car. Fine car. Yeah, and tell them about your yellow light. That oh, you're so I had proud to put of. this. I had to put this on because you can't see these lights at all. But back then, they say they did this for the road. You yeah. know, uh, to see the light or the the, yeah, lights the side of the road. Yeah. Anything yeah. would help back then. Yeah. Wow. But um, the uh, in in these years, they made a pickup truck. They made a two door. They made this with a convertible. Are you serious? They cut it off here and this, wow. the top rolled back. And they made a pickup of this car. A pickup. It's so like, cute. Oh, oh, I bet. It's so cute. Holy um, cow. They made a station wagon, sedan <clears throat> delivery, and they made a hot shot two seater that held the record at uh, Seaburn for the longest time. Wow. And uh, they never got recognition yeah. for the first American sports Two piece windshield. Two piece windshield. Yeah, you don't see much uh, anymore. You know, but. They took these cars and all they did is chopped off back here and they put whatever they wanted. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, but the truck is really cute, you know? Slide, Slide windows. windows. Yeah, that was a, I think roll up was like an uh, $1.98 extra, maybe, well, yeah. maybe 35 cent extra. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This car was like $900 new. Now, what size are those tires? Uh, they're Get a load of those inch. wheels. At 13, 13 inch, right? 13 right, inch right, wheels right. and tires. And I see you got good tires, which we've talked right, about right, before. Right. right. But if uh, you take a look in here, come on in over here. Um, I, I put the old uh, oh, Indian, yeah. Indian blankets on yeah. here. Uh, the, I love the dash. It says Crosley. The, the gauges are beautiful. Now, this is highly optioned. It has a gas gauge and a heater. Ooh, a gas gauge uh, and a heater. Uh, yes, and, yes. Get a, get, and this is the heater down here, correct? Yes, that's yeah, the heater. Look at, look at this heater here. Uh, Chip, I want to show you. Oh, oh wait. I see something right. really cool, though. What's that? The, the, oh, the yeah, piston yeah. gear shift. Piston gear shift. Yeah, just yeah, like same as on the 32. Okay. Take a look at the back there. Look at the seat. Now, this was a family that would go and, and drive anywhere with us. Yeah. Then, well, it's cool. It's it's like you said, it's amazing how right, much right, room right. is in now, there. I, hey, Ralph Nader, remember he took the Corvair off the road? What would you say about this? Oh, nothing oh, there. Yeah. Look at this. Nothing yeah. there. Look at it. Look at it. Yeah. And that's all original. That's all original. Right. I mean, that's that's something like you would have made a home almost. Hey, you know? Exactly. Sheet metal shop class. Now, yeah. now in the back, is there a trunk or anything? No, no trunk. Yeah, so no, no trunk. trunk. So it's a only, nice driving But you do totally have nice. a spot here behind right, the back right. seat that's open. People can hide in here for the drive-in. Yeah. yeah. Man, yeah. this thing is cool. head up. Uh, Look, old, a fine, yeah, what? Crosley, a fine, a fine car. car, and then this is like any motorcycle tail light. Yeah, so they kind of used everything. But what's really and neat this is, is, is this the gas? Gas, yeah, right. that's gas. What's really neat is these first couple of years had a, a tin block, tin, tin, tin engine block. Yeah, fire. Wow. That's what they call a cobra. That was a cobra block. 
Really? Yes. And then after, in 49, uh, they never, didn't last long, but 1949, um, they could replace the block for 89 bucks. Yeah. Wow. $89. Hey, now is this a vent like yes. where you get air? Is, uh, so you can pull this? Oh, yeah. yeah, and these were common back in the that's day. Look at that. So the that's air it. just hits here and goes in here that's and then blows inside. Yes, yes. So more air with that. Now, this car had 44 horse at 26. I mean, uh, 44 cubic inch at 26 horsepower. Wow. It has a 517 rear gear. 517. And it has mechanical brakes. Cable yeah. mechanical brakes. Wow. And it has no synchros in it. Oh. But the engine. <laughs> no synchronizers in the transmission for the grind every, every year. Yeah. Every year. Uh, and just listen to them crying. Uh, I, I painted it last year with a Wagner house sprayer. Yeah. And Rust Oleum. Everybody goes nuts over it. Uh, I'm just going to say, you know what? It looks original. It, it, the paint looks right. like it would be original. Right. And it, it's it's um, what you'd see on a car lot. Actually, you'd probably see it was hand painted. Yeah, the car lot. Yeah, back in the 50s yeah, and 60s. yeah. Actually, I brush painted the wheels. Yeah, can we see the motor? Sure. Now, I've got a surprise about the engine. Right. All right. There's the engine. All right. Hey, real quick, old school. Six it just old, just slides up here and puts it here and locks it. Right. Go ahead. Right. Um, this is a Lou Fagel 44 engine. Okay. After 52, he sold everything, and Lou started building these engines for boats, for hydroplanes. Yeah. And uh, I'll tell you the reason why I meant it. After he was done with it, my uh, what I've read is they use it for marine engines. Yeah. They use it for uh, outboard up to the 70s. Yeah. Inboard, outboard. They used to stick them straight up or put them yeah, down. Yeah. And these were in uh, dur yeah, so durable. Yeah, take a look in here. It's amazing. Well, what What's neat is from here up, it's one piece. There is no head on it. It's a what? mono head. Wow, so it's all one piece, and you okay. can see that. Here's the valve cover. And the valves. So the, so the right. block and the head and everything, right. just one big thing. Right. You can okay. see the oil pan down and, here. And, and what's nice about it, it's built like a modern car up on top. It, they're, they're way over-engineered. Wow. Uh, they were unbelievable. They, they would twist at 5,300 RPM all day. Look at, the, look at this original radiator. Yeah. Look at that. And look at, uh, again, an oil bath, oil bath. air right. filter. Right. So right. here's your air filter. Now this is a top top draft carburetor, right, right. which you can it's see. Standard. So it comes yep. down to the top. A one barrel. Come over here. And look I put at... a high rise one barrel on it. Oh yeah, look. He put a high rise on one it. Barrel so on it. so it's a high rod. Yeah, hot rod. Yeah, you got a hot rod right, valve right, cover. Right. And, you and see, then the water pump works off the generator. Oh, look at that. Look right, right here. Right, right, look right, right here. Right. And then look at the exhaust pipe. That's, <laughs> that's it. I mean that's hardly big enough for I, it's not even big enough for a motorcycle. I know. I know. But I want the biggest thing I want to tell the audience is from here down, this is right here, this aluminum area, that's where the crank sits. It's bolted in its own girdle and it has five main bearings. Now, wow, uh, five main bearings. Yeah, you had three on the flathead. Uh, yeah, three on the flathead. This has five mains. That's, that's why they could motor. twist these to 5,300 all day. Yeah. And they use them in military, boat applications, generators, everything. These this engines. is a cool car. Oh, buddy. yeah. I mean, if anybody ever looked up the history, please look up Crosley. It yeah. is a phenomenal, phenomenal, yeah. uh, this, what he did. This is very, very cool, man. And very, you gotta, very you cool. gotta say the uh, uh, sign of the cross when you go try to stop, okay? Yeah, 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 yeah. It's Mechan a, like you said, mechanical it's, it's brakes. 50, 52 mile an hour car, that's it. Don't push it past that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it, well, it works good. I think we need to take everybody for a let's ride. Go. Let's go. All right, let's, let's go. go. All right, so we're in the Crosley. I don't know if you can hear it running. There you go. Now, so, we are we're got to speak up because the valve noise is a little bit loud. Yeah, okay, all okay, right. So. We'll, we'll talk real loud if we can for you. It sounds like a now, sewing I've, machine lawnmower. Yeah, I've had the same tank again since 1947 there. <laughs> Again, look at this dash, just beautiful. Look at that steering wheel. Oh, I love the horn. No, no. Oh, wow. another option. Oh, you got uh, yeah, look, my, at, look at this. Oh, I know. You don't want to get in a wreck in this thing. Uh, no, no. Yeah, this is crazy. Now, I was driving down the road one day here a couple months ago. I blew the clutch right out of it. Uh, how'd you do that? I, I don't know. I just flew apart. Yeah, pretty pretty easy to work on these, though, right, Steve? Extremely easy. Yeah. Remember, tolerances <laughs> weren't the best back then. Yeah, yeah. That's true, so it'd be easy to rebuild it. Listen to that thing whine. Ah. Uh. 
signals. No signals. Now we're going what, 30 miles an hour? Yeah, so it's taking us. The my little RPM gauge, so you can read it right oh, there. Oh, I, I was going to wonder why you had that. That's my little RPM gauge. That, that tells me how many RPM. Look at you can lug it down and. Oh, yeah. It actually rides nice. Yeah. For what it is. Oh, it, no, it, it absolutely does. I mean, this is. A, I'm looking out that vent he opened up, and it's just a hole. You can see right out to the road over there. Can you see that? Listen, you'll find that motor. So, what the heck do you bring me up here? About 4,200? Right here. Uh, yeah, yeah, about, yeah. I think I better slow down. How about 42? Uh, yeah, mechanical brakes. Hang on! Uh, Almost like a cartoon, huh? Stay. And this is just a